Because if we were going to fall during this job, we couldn't buy the same for all the people. So, this is our Have you heard in the Sahara of Dabushu? By who served the but definitely I will try to have a my own participation in this event. This is the main part of the presentation. Thank you very much. There are two views in case of this, which is touch the part of mobilization. We talk about the issue of law and order, we talk about the issue of the politicization of the issues. If you take one by one, definitely we can reach to somewhere. Socialist and capitalist viewpoint. These issues are not new. These have always been there with the evolution of the society. We know the Vedic society has gone into the industrial world, and in the industrial world we have all been the globalization. Had we not come into the globalization, the many apparatus, technological products which we are using today, they would not have been with us. And if they not my thought process, it's not a question of any particular party, a question of any particular thought process, any decision making. If you have to go and grow in the life, you have to evolve. You have to understand from the outside world. Choice is very individual. If you want to grow, you have to look upon. Technology transfer, patents, intellectual capital. Had they not been here, the multinational would not have come. Had multinational not have come, we would have been deprived of all the technology. Our country is still a developing country, not a developing country. Many things are there which we have yet to achieve and it will take a new course of time for it. When we talk about the cross diversification, needless to say, it is the need of the hour. Mm -hmm. so as the Bill also said, yes, Paddy, a person of Paddy is a high and issues are there for us. We are, our country is 70 of sedimentary member countries. There are a lot of findings on us. These kind of the free electricity, water, these are subsidies. Yesterday also was in the CNN, the Western world is really crying that why this developing country is the name of one or the other issue they are giving, one or the other link to the earth. People, may it be industry, may it be a leader. We are giving the free electricity. I don't want to touch about the critical color of that. Yes, our system is like it. Every party tries to occupy the seat and the power position by giving and offering something which we call premiums. Right now we talked about the electricity. Earlier we have been talking about the water. Yes, directive principles imposing on the government responsibility to provide every month. But that does not mean the government is supposed to provide the free things to the society. Yes, down there people are there, the government provides them the benefits in one or the other way. But trade part, we talk about the trade part, it's a individual decision making. Why agriculture only? There are so many other trades that are also there. Everybody will expect that yes, we should also have one or the other kind of support. Facilitation of the trade is in the interest of the economy of the country. Every country makes the efforts for facilitating the trade part so that we come completely. More infrastructure, more simpler rules and regulations. Less interference, inspectors are what we used to say. Taking care of all those things helps any state, any country for facility. Law and order it is the duty of the nation to maintain internal security, at the same time taking care of the 
security of the citizens of the country from the outward agencies and outward countries. In Indonesia, we have already witnessed it. How attacks have been made repeatedly for one or the other issue, or in the one or the other reason, trying to capture. And it's not only for our country. We all are educated, we all are having exposure to various information which keeps on passing through our eyes and mind. Everywhere across the globe, one or the other way is being found out by one or the other country to infiltrate, to disturb the tranquility, maybe the drugs. Yes, it's a very unfortunate. Our own state where we are sitting has been the victim of it. But it's not the new thing. If you look into the detail part, global prisons. Uh, two months back I had a chance to participate in an international conference for key prisons of the world. It was also there. Why, why security is needed? Why any country spend a lot of billions of dollars for their security? Had there been a sense of understanding that nobody will be disturbing the other country, you just imagine how many billions of dollars will be saved. In every country, every country, how small or big it is, they spend money. Developed countries, they are into manufacturing of the weapons, arteries, they are supplying it. You just imagine how much money our country is spending on weapons. This is the issue. It's not an issue of the Punjab state. Yes, today we have assembled here to talk about the Punjab state, but it's not only the state to the Punjab. We have to be open minded. We have to be in consonance with our status to develop ourselves, to eradicate something which is wrong in the state, make the political system. May it be bureaucratic system, but yes, wherever the reforms are needed, we should come forward. Now, who has to take the lead to bring the changes? We are looking towards the ministry. Ministry is who? We have elected them. We can't blame them subsequently that we elect them and then we blame them that they are working wrong. May it be an individual or a group of people, those who have not passed their ballot in a particular manner or to a particular party. But yes, majority has won it and the party is ruling. May it be the last state, may it be any other state out of the 29 states in the country. This is the responsibility of the electoral, electorate. That's it. When the time comes, what ideology we are looking for? We are giving the mandate to the parties and they start ruling. And then we are left with sadness and defense of suffering. I am personally this opinion. We have created the awareness among the society on this part. We have created the awareness among the society, mainly through NGOs, mainly through other channels. We should see that the society is fully aware about it. We don't get swayed away by anybody's or any parties or statements. If we want to have change in the crop management system, we are being made aware and afraid of it that the multinational companies will take away our crops and other things. This hypothetically something can be talked about. But what is the effect? When we signed the product patent act, we brought Indian patent act, there was a fear. Lot of news were there, I am talking about 1995, that the medicine pricing will be skyrocketing. It will be away from the reach of the common person. What is the truth? What is the fact? Under the molecules have come into the country which were not in the reach of the common person for various reasons. There were the drugs which used to be imported, and now those drugs are freely available. Let's we put our heads together in this. I'm of this concern. Instead of applying the 
four percent from the mind of the others. Each citizen of the country, each citizen of the state, they have to understand it. We are having intellect. Intellect should go from the mind, not from the heart. We have to find out what is the right or wrong, where it will take us. And if we find something substantially and scientifically proven with the statistics that yes, something is going wrong, we should come forward, raise the voice, and use various platforms to address this. So thank you very much to you for supporting.